The Law of Diminishing Returns, also known as the Law of Diminishing Marginal Returns, states that increasing one factor of production generate lower returns. For this example, we use a lawn care company. Let's say you have one employee, one work truck, and the same equipment to mow houses. With one employee, I could only mow five houses in one day. If I needed to increase the production of houses mowed to increase my profits, I would add another employee. Two employees would be able to mow 15 houses in one day. If I had a third employee, they would be able to mow 20 houses in one day. If I added a fourth employee, they would be able to mow 25 houses in one day. If I added a fifth employee, they would be able to cut 28 houses in one day. If I added a sixth employee, they would be able to mow 30 houses in one day. So as you can see in the graph, once they hit three or four employees, the returns start to diminish because I'm only changing one factor in my production. If I were to maybe split up the employees and add a second work truck and and more equipment, I would be able to increase my overall productivity. But since I'm only changing one factor, it produces lower and lower returns each time. This law is extremely important and powerful to understand for any business owner as it lets us know that you cannot increase one factor in production without generating lower and lower returns. You must change different aspects in your production to increase overall productivity.